Tyler, Philadelphia Cheesesteak Tour. And we're at Peter and Sons Sandwiches in Glassboro, New Jersey. And here we have a unique sandwich because the ribeye is sliced here. The bread is Lissio's, but it's actually extra baked slightly for them, just for the, just for the uh, Peter and Sons. And of course, American cheese. It's got a little firmness to the roll. Taste of Russell. Kind of interfering with the whole cheese thing. The roll's good. Not like a seven four. Very good roll. I like the firmness of the roll being like to bake. But I really don't get any flavor out of this at all. The gristle certainly turns me off a little bit. And it's just really lacking flavor. Yeah, I'm I'm a I'm gonna be seven three. I can't even go seven four on this one. Um, you know, it's just a to me it's a college town cheesesteak. Okay. It's tough to uh, be the third one to go after uh, after hearing those uh, from looks. Uh, slab, tell it's fresh. I see the cheese on the bottom, not mixed throughout. Kind of tough to do that on a slab steak. We said that before. So let me just get in here for that bite. I like the roll. I like that yeah. crispiness on the outside. So let me get in here. Now I strategically chose that bite so I get a good amount of cheese in it. Yeah, I mean... Not bad, but you're right there. There's not a lot of flavor to the meat itself. The meat stands alone, but it could have used a little bit of seasoning, I believe, in the cooking process to bring that flavor out a little bit. Enhancement, a little pepper, a little salt, just to bring that very good quality meat. Pretty moist. Man. I'm at a seven. There you go.